today, we will see some misconceptions related to the comparison of rational numbers and an interesting method to do comparisons. Misconception Which of the following rational numbers is greater than minus 21 by 18? Students often ignore the signs and compare rational numbers. This is an incorrect understanding of doing comparisons. Students see that in option 1, the given denominator is equal to the denominator in the question and 30 is greater than 21. Therefore, they think that option 1 is the correct answer. This is incorrect because if we mark minus 21 by 18 and minus 30 by 18 on the number line, we will see that minus 30 by 18 is to the left of minus 21 by 18. Therefore, minus 30 by 18 is smaller than minus 21 by 18. Comparison can also be done as follows. Here, without the sign, the value 30 is greater than 21. When we add the sign to numbers, then we use the sign that is the opposite of the sign used in comparison. Therefore, we will write minus 30 is lesser than minus 21. On the number line also, since minus 30 is located to the left of minus 21, it is smaller. Likewise, some students think that the numerator of the rational number in option 2, that is minus 21 by 17, and the rational number in the question, that is minus 21 by 18, are equal. And because the numerator of the rational number in option 2 is smaller, therefore, this will be a greater rational number. Therefore, they select option 2 as the correct answer, which is incorrect. Comparison can also be done as follows. First, we will ignore their signs. By ignoring the sign, we notice that the numerator of both the numbers are the same, but the denominators are different. In such situations, the rational number whose denominator is greater is the smaller rational number, and the rational number whose denominator is smaller is the greater rational number. That means, 21 by 17 is greater than 21 by 18. Now, if we add the sign here, we will need to add the opposite sign of the sign of comparison. That means, minus 21 by 17 is lesser than minus 21 by 18. Option 3 has an integer. Some students don't understand that an integer is also a rational number. So by looking at minus 1, they think that this cannot be the answer of the given question which is incorrect. Every integer is a rational number because it can be expressed in the p by q form where p and q are integers and q is not equal to 0. Now let's compare the rational numbers minus 21 by 18 and minus 1 or minus 1 by 1. Here, if we multiply the numerator and the denominator of minus 1 by 1 by 18, then we get an equivalent rational number of minus 1 by 1 as minus 18 by 18. Because the denominators are the same, we compare the numerators. Since minus 21 is less than minus 18, therefore, minus 21 by 18 is less than minus 18 by 18, which means minus 21 by 18 is less than minus 1. If we represent minus 21 by 18 on the number line, then we can see that minus 21 by 18 is to the left of minus 1. Therefore, the correct answer to the question is option 3. Now let's look at an interesting method to compare rational numbers. Suppose we want to compare 4 by 13 and 3 by 11. To compare the two numbers, we will multiply the numerator 4 of the first rational number with the denominator 11 of the second rational number. The result we get is 44. Similarly, we will multiply the numerator 3 of the second rational number with the denominator 13 of the first rational number. The result we get is 39. Here we see 44 is greater than 39. Therefore, we can say that 4 by 13 is greater than 3 by 11. Let's compare minus 12 by 5 and minus 13 by 6. Now here, by multiplying the numerator minus 12 of the first number with the denominator 6 of the second number, we get a result minus 72. And by multiplying the numerator minus 13 of the second number with the denominator 5 of the first number, we get a result minus 65. 
Since minus 72 is lesser than minus 65, we say that minus 12 by 5 is lesser than minus 13 by 6. If we compare 9 by 12 and 3 by 4 in the same way, then by multiplying the numerator 9 of the first number by the denominator 4 of the second number, we will get the result 36. And by multiplying the numerator 3 of the second number by the denominator 12 of the first number, we get a result 36. In both situations, the result is equal. Therefore, we will say that 9 by 12 is equal to 3 by 4. In general, suppose P by Q and R by S are both rational numbers in which Q is not equal to 0 and S is not equal to 0, then their comparison can be done in the following ways. Pause the video and understand. This is an easy method of comparison. With this method, rational numbers can be compared orally. Today, we saw some misconceptions related to the comparison of rational numbers and an interesting method of doing comparisons.